Hello everyone! We are here in our newly redone classroom. I can't wait to show you all of the neat things that we have done in here um, to make it a new and fresh place. Um, maybe I'll, oh, I'll send some pictures. So go ahead and look for some pictures um, that'll be below in the comments for some of the neat stuff around the room. They're really, really, really thrilled. So what I wanted to do today is share with you a song that I wrote years ago when I was um, having a hard time, but also feeling hopeful. So um, I feel like the song would apply for now. It is on iTunes, it's on Apple Music, it's on CD Baby, um, and every once in a while, it, well, it's on YouTube and then it keeps on getting taken off. When it gets to a certain level of people who've watched it and whatever, then all of a sudden it stops because CD Baby stops it, turns it off and starts it fresh again. So the link keeps, you know, needing to be changed. But um, it is available on there. Um, and I thought it was good for this season while we're in quarantine. And it's about God's wisdom being the treasure. And um, so I wanted to read today as our devotion a devotion about treasure. It's called Treasure Hunt. It says, as the scripture verse, again, the kingdom is heaven, of heaven is like a trader who was looking for fine pearls. He found one that was very valuable, so he sent away, though see, he went away and sold everything he had, and he bought that pearl from Matthew 13. So treasure hunt. Have you ever gone on a treasure hunt? What's the most valuable thing you have? For some people, it's a computer or a tablet. Others have an old coin that's been in the family for years. Maybe it's fancy jewelry that used to belong to a grandmother or great-grandmother. When you have something valuable, you take good care of it. You might keep it in a special box or hide it somewhere so no one else can find it. But what if you lost it? That would be upsetting. You would search very hard until you found it. You might even stay up past your bedtime. In the book of Matthew, Jesus told his disciples that God's kingdom was like a treasure. Jesus told a story about a businessman searching for a pearl an expensive and precious jewel. When the man found the perfect pearl, he knew it was worth a lot of money. So he sold everything he owned to get the money to buy it. And the thought for today is, I can search for God's kingdom like it's a treasure. Jesus came to earth searching for us and gave up all he had to be with us. His love is the most valuable thing we have. As he helps us understand his love for us, we can show our love for him. When we give up everything else to put him first, we're like the man who bought the pearl. Learning all about Jesus and his kingdom is like hunting for treasure. If we spend time searching, we will find something priceless. So to read more, it says, read Proverbs 2 one through five. And my, the song that I wrote um, is Proverbs 24, three and four. With wisdom, a house is built and with knowledge, it is made. I changed the words a tiny bit. So I'm like, which one's the song and which one's scripture? Um, with knowledge, basically it's made secure. And with, um, with understanding, it's filled with priceless treasures. So I will leave that below for you to hear, and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.